Greetings and welcome back, Graveyard Keepers, to, of course, Graveyard Keeper, where we've got a few things to drop off here, if we can. Let's have a quick peek. Can we drop off the honey? We can drop off the honey. Marvellous, marvellous, marvellous. Because we need more cakes. All of the cakes. But before that, we're going to have to get some more, uh, more, um, firewood. We'll, we'll take care of that in a moment. But first, we need to get down into the morgue. Now, the morgue is a funny one. Whereas getting to the church is faster through the tunnel, getting to the morgue takes about one and a half times as long, I would like to say. Ooh, this is a fairly easy cup. I guess we're not having a funeral pyre then. <sighs> Comrade Donkey bringing us useful corpses. I don't know. Oh, well. But a quick status update. We're about on day 120. My alpha playthrough managed to get to day 100, uh, sorry, 260, so we're a little bit under halfway there right now. However, however, uh, we are only one point behind the alpha in terms of our um, church quality, and uh, a fair, a fair bit behind the uh, graveyard. I think the graveyard got up to quality 170. So, uh, we're a little bit behind there. But it's fine. It's fine. We'll make it work. Uh, let's get you going. We are eventually going to have to change a lot of these. Because right now, we're not making the most out of each grave. Not even close. But, you know, we are at least getting something done. Uh, we'll set you up as well. May as well get that extra point. Also, I'm going to sneeze. Oh, that came from my boots. Right, let's get you out of the way. Uh, we don't have any of that, so we're just going to break you down. And we'll probably destroy it later as well. There we are, let's get in a nice little fence. It'll give us a point. A point that we wouldn't have had otherwise, so that's fine. Uh, would you be a better new? How about you? Yes, let's get you sorted then. There we are, up to almost. In fact, with the next one, if yeah, we're lucky enough. There we are. We're over 130. Nice. Very, very nice. About 49, sorry, 48 away from matching our old, uh, our old area, our old graveyard. And that was using all of that side as well, which is quite impressive when you think about it. Um, well, we are going to need... Oh, we need to store this, but for now, I guess we'll leave that there, um, since I can use that in the church soon-ish. I think today we're going to need to head over to the mining outpost and spend a little bit of time over there, so we're probably going to take uh, a decent amount of things with. Uh, Comrade Donkey is going to be delivering one more corpse, though, so I want to wait on that, rather than... Go over there and then just let leave a corpse in the in the morgue just decaying. Now that it doesn't sit well with me, not even slightly. So we will, ooh, we will swoop through. Oh, there we are. Got some pumpkins on the go. Very nice. Let's uh, get these going as well. And we will head up, get some grapes planted. There we are. Uh, again, I'm not really going to prioritize grabbing any more food from the farm. We we just don't need it. Beets and carrots are about the only ones that I will because they are so so easy to to make lots of. Uh, and cause we can just turn them all into something, you know, reasonably useful straight away. So that seems seems sensible to me at the very least. Uh, we will set up more trellises, but that's not a priority right now. Let's go and drop some things off in the cellar, shall we? I think we should. Alright, let's drop off the blood, the skin, and the fat, since we can stack all of those. Uh, in terms of grapes, we've got a lot. Wow. Okay. Let's get that on the go then, shall we? I really, really wish we could multiply these, but... Uh, uh, sorry, uh, we could, say, do this many with this quality of grape. I mean, it doesn't seem like something that the, the game should struggle with in terms of working out, oh yeah, he can, or no, no, he doesn't have enough to do that. Okay, another batch of silver wine, straight up and going. Oh, well, we don't know if it's going to be silver wine in the end, but, you know, we'll, we'll give it a, a good try. There we go. Go ahead. 
And at this point, I'm starting to need a second um, wine cask. Hmm. Maybe. Maybe that is something we can start looking into. At, oh, you know what, though? I wouldn't mind dipping down into the... into the dungeon for a little bit. Um... Hmm. And I totally forgot to go and throw that coin at, at Snake. Oh, well. I'm sure we'll get another chance. There's so many things I need to do. So many things. I need I need to be more efficient at doing the so many things, but... Uh, we've got to go into the dungeon. We've also got to head over into the mining outpost at some point later today. Get that sorted as well. Let's go ahead and plant the silver down here. There we are. And one there as well. And we won't plant those yet. I'll wait until next round and then we'll fully plant out an area. That way everything will be kept a little bit more um, in line. Now, I suppose we could have a snooze, I guess. Uh, ahead of going into the dungeon. Because the, the dungeon is somewhere I really, really would like to go. Uh, there we are. Thank you very much, Comrade Donkey. And since we'll be going to the dungeon, I am going to need to take a fair few things with me on that trip. We'll come back up with a whopping great load of, uh, of metal scrap, though, which will be very, very useful. All right, let's have a look at this corpse. Are you a beauteous corpse, or are you a corpse for the pyre? I, honestly, I wouldn't mind either way right now. You are... Honestly, you're half and half. You're as sinful as you were virtuous. Well done. Walk, walking the, the fine line of balance there. I mean, ultimately, you're going to be going to the hottest part of hell because you refuse to pick a side. But, uh, you know, I, I, think it, I think it's actually more work to be exactly as virtuous as you are sinful. Myself. Oh, wow. There we go. Well done. You had a particularly sinful brain. I am going to blame vanity. You are a particularly vain person, but worry not. I fixed you. I fixed you by taking out all of that vanity. We're not even going to take your bones. You know what? That's fine. That's fine. We're going to have to dig a proper big grave for you because I haven't deboned you. But it's okay. It is fine. We will make this work. All right, let's get you up here then. And into a lovely grave. Eventually we will decorate the grave so that it is even more lovely. But for now, that will do. There we go. Thank you. Actually, we've got a headstone that I can put on there. Uh, at least I believe we do. Yes, we've got several headstones, actually. Okay, not too bad. There we go. Nice, big old grave there. Perfect. All right, we'll drop off. Well, we're not going to drop off anything here, actually. Uh, we're dropping all of that elsewhere. Okay. Got to leave the mushrooms in the house. A lot of my tools. Pretty much everything but my axe and my pickaxe are going to be left behind. Don't need any of those. Right, there we go. Let's drop that off as well. Ah, now then. Do I really want do I want to grab those? Yes, I do. Um, drop my hammer off. Drop my shovel off. And that's actually all we need to drop off, which is particularly good. Okay. Alright, I think that's uh we've got a plan. Let's uh, drop these off there though. Uh wow. You know what, before we get too distracted, can I cut any firewood? I can. So let's go ahead and do that then. Then we'll grab a snooze, then we'll head down into the dungeon for a day before the sermon. Yeah. And we'll also get some more cakes ready for the next opportunity to sell them to our rather gluttonous friend who can't taste anything. So it's really a wonder why he's still so gluttonous when you think about it. Uh, right. Uh, I guess we're only having two cakes, but that's fine. Right. Top up. There we go. And also, top up for me. Uh, some Assam for those who are curious. Right, let's go. So refreshed. Good times. Let's drop the cake off. We'll bring all of the... Oh, we'll drop that cake off too then. Okay. Uh, I wonder what else we're going to get going. Um, I'm going to say probably more baked mushrooms then. Sure. That'll do. Right. Are we going to take wine with us? He says just as more wine is prepared. 
Uh, I'm going to say probably yes. Also, let's get even more wine made. Unfortunately, it looks like that wine. Yeah, it, it ended up not being the best of wines. I'm going to take 10 of them. Just so that I can heal should I need to. And I suspect I will. Let's organize the inventory now. Ready. There we are. No point in taking the, the warp stone. Can't use it while we're down in the, in the dungeon. So, all right. Now, we're going to be going deeper than I've ever been before in the dungeon. It's going to be a bit of an experience for me. Let's go and have a look at what we can do. I've really got to work on the on the evilness of this sacrificial zone. All right. Dungeon layer six. What are we going to find down here, then? Hopefully, something marvelously not... Ooh. Hellbat. Hmm. Okay. Hello? No. Oh, okay. So you're leaving a trail of lava. Not too surprised, if I'm perfectly honest. Heal potions. Actual healing potions. Very well. I accept. I imagine I'm going to be using those quite a lot in this place. If I'm dealing with hellbats. Nope. Right, just once. And again. And again. There we go. Just take your time. No reason to be silly about this. There we go. Now, I have no idea what blue jelly is useful for. Are you coming? Yes, you are. There we go. Good. One thing, you two. It would be lovely if you would take damage from the lava. That would be especially nice. Ouch. Hurt a little bit, but it's okay. All right. What we got? We've got some gold star onion seeds. Don't mind those. One little bit. In fact, I quite like them. find down here. We have found gold, maybe? Whoosh. Nope. Ouch. Nope. And then you. Ah. Uh, come on then. And ouch. There we go. I have to be using that healing potion before too long. Now let's clear the room first. Make sure that everything in here that could be a nuisance is dead looks like. Right, can I even mine that, though? It's the question that's on my mind. Is that possible for me to mine, or is it locked? It is possible for me to mine. Alright. Let's uh, gobble down some food. Uh, gold nugget. A decent chunk of gold nuggets. Okay, we only get one mine from these. Okay. Hello. Ouch. On then. Both of you, please, at the same time. That was actually quite glorious. Nope. I imagine stepping on the lava is probably going to be more damaging than actually getting hit by the bats. I don't know, because so far the bats have been kind of a little bit lackluster in terms of their damage, considering they look like hell bats. I was expecting a little bit more, if I'm perfectly honest with you. There we are. We're probably going to spend all the time down here right up until the sermon, if I can, if I can manage it. If there's no particular reason for me to go back up, then then I'm going to just stay down in the dungeon. We've got some healing. We've got 11 items capable of healing. One of them is capable of a lot of healing, I believe. Uh, let's have a look. 30. Oh, actually, they're both exactly the same. All right. Well, that's not too bad, then. All right. Now, the gold nuggets. We may be able to turn those into some refined jewelry on books, which would be useful, since that would allow us to make some of the nicer books. Come on, you. You coming? Haha! -ha, you fool! Fell into my trap, you did! Oh, you're just giving me more of these useless bloody nails. Come on. Then. And you as well, please. I'm glad that there is more um, variety in the enemies here, though. I'm quite pleased with that, I've got to be honest. I was a little bit worried that we wouldn't see much in terms of variety. Okay, I'm going to quaff that and get up to full health again. Or almost full health, perhaps. And then... There we go. And four for one. I approve. And another health potion. I also approve. Well done. Keeping the stocks going. Now, what are we going to find up here? This is not the exit point, which is good. Nope. Come on, then. That's perfect. Both of you just stay there. Thank you. That worked well. Were they taking damage from the... Uh, 
from the the fire because that Iron Maiden went down faster than I was expecting them to go down, honestly. I've actually got a lot more reach with this weapon as well than I'm giving it credit. I'm often getting a lot closer than I need to, I'm starting to notice. Just because when I go for the shots that I don't think, oh, there's no, there's no way that's going to connect, I've, I've wasted my energy there. It actually does connect, and I'm like, oh, right, okay, uh, perhaps I should uh, look into that a little bit more later then. Now, the unfortunate thing here is I'm, I may have underestimated the amount of energy I'm using killing all of these enemies. Come on then. Nope. Come on. I'll do. Nope. Ah. There we go. Uh, okay, there's some sort of sacrificial pit down here. I'd rather you didn't. Nope. And then, there we are. Thank you. Gotta be polite. Just because I'm killing them doesn't mean I, I need to be rude about it. Pleases and thank yous go a long way. Alright, let's go back through the portal and down to level 7. I'm not going to worry about heading into uh, going and talking to the astrologer today. It's about the only thing I would want to do with my day. Uh, so for now, we can just keep on going. Right, so this would be level 7. It might take us... Ooh, silver perhaps? Hello. Thank you. Very polite of you. Attacking me one at a time. It is appreciated. There we are. I'm not so keen on picking up the bloody nails considering how ridiculously expensive in terms of labour costs they are to clean. I was excited initially when I realised I could clean them, but when it became obvious that you clean them one at a time, it's like, oh, really? Why? The same process would clean all of them as would clean one of them. Just with maybe a little bit more, more vigorous shaking of your sand-filled sieve. Nope. Ah! Why am I moving upwards? I seem to be uh, under the effect of some strange curse. Hello. Kind of need all of you to come down here at once, please. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. No. Nope. Uh, damn it. Those, those bees are actually... Uh, sorry, bees, I say. Uh, flies are actually a little bit frustrating. Because they're, they're as fast as I am, so I can't flee from them very effectively. Right, okay. What do we not need? Well, first and foremost, we don't need that anymore. What else do we not need? Um... I kind of need all of it. I don't know what the blue jelly is useful for. I don't need one wheat seed. So that can go. Uh, lentil seed is better. And I don't need the flitch. So the flitch can go too. Grape seed. That's actually much more valuable, yeah. I'll accept that. It's a shame that we're unable to gather all of the flitch, though. That is a bit of a shame. Uh, actually, considering... Just don't want these. They can go. Oh, yeah, and we'll keep the nails. Sure. Okay, so we're having to make some sacrifices. The flitch is the primary one. But that should be fine. Let's uh, top up on apples. In fact, if we eat another four, then we can start collecting the flitch again. What? Don't want to know what you can do. You look cute, though. I like you. Ah, you're spitting at me. You still look cute. Ouch. Stop your shenanigans. Guess I'm gonna have that. Okay, the spiders are a little bit more tricksy. And I collect spider's web from them. Oh. See, I imagine the main thing that these are gonna be useful for is uh, alchemy. That would be my guess. They're gonna be alchemy drops. Okay. Are we ever going to find anything in these? Oh, well, we can't even open that one, so no. No, the answer on that one is a definite not. Not going to find anything there. Hello. Clearly the spiders are the most dangerous thing we've encountered so far. I'm knackered. Damn it. I guess we have been down in a dungeon for what accounts for, like, several days now. Hello. Yeah, right, that'll do. Another spider, alright. Trixie, but... 
I think I'm up to the task. Come hither. Bat. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Why? Why are you being so mean? Nope. That's right. Gonna keep you cornered. But that really, really hurts. Destroy the bloody nails. Don't need them. Uh, I will, however, quaff some uh, some wine. Because being drunk in a dungeon doesn't sound dangerous at all. No, no. Quite the opposite, I'll have you know. It is exactly what we need right now. Copious amounts of wine. To forget how mean the spiders were. Despite how lovely they look. Come on. I'd like you to be dead if you would be so kind as to oblige. Thank you. And then spiders. Nope. Rather uh, attack you there. That's yes, right. Now I don't have to worry about the bat. I don't want a pot. What a silly thing. No. Come on over here. Let's fight in the corridor where you can't back away as easily. No. Nope. Ha ha! Got you. Uh, no, we're not taking a ceramic bowl with us. I need to keep my inventory open for the potential of healing pots. What are we going to find down here? Iron Maidens. Oop. Very agile Iron Maidens today. Ouch. And then you. My alcohol gives me strength. Also courage. Also stupidity. Also blindness to my pain. Ouch. I'm just going to... I'm... I, I've kind of got a feeling that face tanking is becoming the primary way of doing this. And then... Right, that's one down. Filling me up with bloody nails again. Wah! That is unfair that you get to move so many times. Disapprove. Let's get rid of you. I've got to be honest, I do, do like the spider mobs. Oh, I flubbed that one. Did you just smash a... You did. You smashed some sort of urn, I think. Hello. Nope. Okay, I guess yes. Alright. There we go. I need energy, though. Quite a lot, actually. Who knew I was going to go through all of my energy supplies this fast? Alright. Alright then, bats. Come on now. Let's, let's form a nice orderly queue. There's enough of me for everyone. Actually, there isn't. If you all tried to eat me at once, I would run out. Please don't. Right. There we are. Ouch, ouch. Backhand swing for the win. Wasn't what I was trying to do, but it was fun. Alright. Okay, so there's a couple of things we need to destroy here. You for one. Let's get rid of you. Lentil seeds. Beet seeds are not important enough for me to drop anything else I'm carrying. So, those can wait. Hello. Come then. Two for... There we go. Nice. Are these ones I can open? No. No. And indeed, no. Ouch. Hello. I... For a moment there, I thought you were friendly, and you're like, "Nah, I don't want to fight you. I just, I just want to have a chat." Yeah, you scoundrel. Okay, down to level eight. Wheat seeds that I don't care for. Oh, that was that was a bit of a saga, but uh, okay. All right, we we've done it. We went through a ridiculous amount of beets, a ridiculous amount of apples, and a fair chunk of our wine too, considering we had healing items as well. Uh, right, I'm going to leave one of these there. I'm going to leave one of those there. I'm going to leave all of those there. Uh, the spider web, I need to know what you can be made into first. Gold and silver nuts. No, no, no. We're going to keep all of those. All right. Good enough for me. Let us be gone from this place. We need a snooze before our sermon today. Thank you very much for the wine. Uh, all right. Anything we want to drop off in here? No. No, nothing we want to drop up there. Let's head in. Oh, glorious. Uh, should we get some more apples? Hmm. I don't think so. I don't think that's necessary, really. Ah, so we're going to be able to make lasagna. Oh, it's going to be grand. Truly. I need to get more honey. 
That is the primary thing that I need to deal with right now, honey. Uh, right, let's drop off all of this wonderful stuff. I can't drop off that wonderful stuff. That, that makes me sad. Do I have enough coal? I do. Marvellous. Let's get a load of this made then. All 160 of it. 16 iron ingots are being made uh, right now. Where am I going to store these, though? Oh, well, that's just not convenient at all. Complete lack of convenience. Uh, oh, actually, I can pick up my tools. Okay, that makes things a little bit easier. There we are. And I guess I'll drop off some of the other things in here, then. The blue slimes can go in there. The various certificates can go, can go in there as well. All right. Good enough for me for now. Do I have anything else I want to drop off? Yes, I've got loads of seeds I want to drop off. And pick up some iron ingots on the way. Oh, okay. Never, never a chance to rest as a graveyard keeper. If you're looking for a profession, I don't recommend graveyard keeper. Very, very hard work. Uh, right, onion seed, a lentil seed. I'll keep the grape seed, we'll store that elsewhere. Uh, okay. Not bad. I guess I'm probably going to end up using a lot of those maggots fishing anyway, so it's not too bad to have them there, though. I should imagine that we will eventually just um, use a lot of the maggots in alchemy. Fairly certain they break down into something useful. I can't remember what, though, but uh, I'm pretty certain they did. Oh, damn it. Um, what can I take from in here? Uh, is there really anything I want to take over there? Not really, if I'm perfectly honest. Uh, oh, the teleport stone. There we are. Hooray! Don't worry, we are going to be going and dealing with the uh, the church in a moment. There we are. Now, if I'm super lucky, I may have enough time to make everything I need to take the... Oh, not if I replant all of the grapes, though. No, we're going to wait for those grapes to finish maturing before we replant. Uh, it's it's fine. It'll, it'll slow down our wine um, production by a little bit, but it's, it's fine. If we're super lucky, I may have enough items to hand to be able to make everything we need for the advanced pews. So, first and foremost, let's make two more simple parts. There we are. And then make a bunch of complex parts. Cobble down some more food. There we are. Then I'm going to need this. I think we need two. I think this is going to result in us not having enough, unfortunately. I'm going to have some wine. You know what? Sure. We deserve it. We're working hard today. This is hard, hard work. Uh, can I grab some planks as well? Am I going to need one more wooden plank? I think I do. I, I'm i really not certain that we have enough here. We'll hope. We'll hope. But uh, I'm not going to hold my breath on this one, I'm afraid. Really not going to hold my breath on this one. We'll see if we've got enough to be able to put together one of the fancy pews. Uh, actually, have we even got enough time to do that? Hmm. No. No, if we're lucky, we will get down, we will grab the prayer, and we will be able to get the the sermon done. But we do not have enough time to faff around with building anymore. Much sadness, that. There we go. Oh, thank goodness, we managed to get the sermon. That's the important part. I'd like to say some words. After I take a sip of tea. Our church tea. I mean, great. And let us play, pray for this blessing. We'll see if we can start upgrading the, the pews as soon as we can. There we go. Thank you very much. Ah, oh, perfect. Ah, oh, flood of serotonin. I approve. Great sermons. I know, I know. I'm, I'm pretty good at it. That's the point. There we go. Thank you very much for your contributions. You know what, let's go and have a quick chat with our friend outside and see. Um, I'm ready to upgrade the church. Leave, 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 leave. 
Building permission. I'm ready to upgrade the church. Good, very- What? Your magic! I'm gonna tell the Inquisitor about you! I'm no fan of this modern architecture. There's far too much light in here for my tastes. But our modern faithful citizens, they'll enjoy it. Mark my words, in ten years, some of them might even learn how to read. What a crazy time this is. Indeed. By the way, I think you should make the donation box bigger. And speaking of donations, are you aware that in order to perform a ceremony in the big church, you'll need to be a rightful citizen? Uh, not really. Oh, then I must have forgotten to mention it. No wonder I have so many important things on my mind. Just show me your rightful citizen papers and I'll gladly open the big church. Uh, where are my rightful citizen papers? Poop! Poop! Drat! Damn and blast! I have got them! Oh wow, I need a lot more. I need two more. Oh, that's not so great. Uh, oh, can I put them down? Ah, <gasps> I can! Excellent times of these! I need more! Oh! You're just there! I, I, I am a rightful citizen, aren't I? Yes, I'm fairly certain I am! I'll be right back! Don't mind me! Oh, we need rightful citizen papers, which I believe I had squirreled away in my box back here! Let me go and have a look! Thank. Rightful citizen papers. Perfect. Right. Please still be there. Uh, we may be lucky. It might not be. It does depend. This is... Yeah, I'm still fairly certain that getting to the front of the church is still faster going through the salad. But I've got a funny feeling that, that, that the bishop will already be gone. Come on, bishop, still be there. Ow! Scatterbags. Oh, well. I guess I'll just leave these there then. That's not the worst thing in the world. Uh, right. Okay, so we're going to need a number of, of simple metal parts to get the wall candelabras. Uh, I don't know how... Oh, we've got things back there. <gasps> marvellous. Absolutely marvellous. Could I fit uh, a pew back there? Uh, one, two, three, seven. No. Alas. Maybe wooden church shrines back there, though. Or oh, very... various other things, I guess. Now, we don't get any more pews, though. From what I can see, that's a bit of a... bit of a shame. Oh, someone wishes to confess. CONFESS! Thank you. I feel, I feel I've got to say it a little bit more sinister. I, I don't know why, but... Uh, there we are. Still, there's no need not to thank them afterwards. The sinister part is already done. Right, let's find out a little bit about stuff. I would like to find out about this stuff. Very well. What are you then? You decompose into powder and essence. Marvelous. And how about... Oh! Oh! I forgot! I forgot! <laughs> I'm sorry. Shush. I remembered before I'd done too much though. So that's okay. Use. I'm just going to drop that in there, along with these. There we are. Right, I think I might need some more paper, actually. Uh, sure. Let's, in fact, let's get all of that done. All ten of them. I know, I know, I'm, I'm doing this instead of studying. But I need the paper, you see. So I might as well get it. There we are. 66 faith so far. It's not too bad. I've got a bunch of things that I can make now that would get me more faith, though. Uh, of a tricky one, that. Should I go for that instead? Uh, no, no. We're gonna we're gonna work on on everything else for now, as as we've got it down here, because we've got a load of things stored in the scroll shelf that we just don't want in the scroll shelf, frankly. So if I can just get those studied enough that I can get rid of them, then that would actually be better for me. All right. Okay. So first and foremost, uh, let's study the blue jelly. I'm sure this will have great insight. Uh, fluid and essence, okay. And what next? We'll study hemp. Uh, we will not study hemp. We will become more scientific first, and then we will study hemp. Which takes four. Powder and essence. I can only assume... Wow. 
I can only assume that that is actually going to be quite useful. Grapes as well. Wow. Oh, wow. Everything is a little bit expensive here. Okay, that's not so bad then. What about you? Sure. We'll study these mushrooms then. There we go. Can't decompose it. Wow. That surprises me. I'm really shocked by that. I was expecting to be able to break that down into like life essence or something. Okay. That's not going to be on the cards then. Uh, got a couple of new stories though. Drop off a bunch of this. There we are. And now we don't need these clogging up this, this area anymore. Don't need those clogging up the area anymore. That's pretty good. Uh, the river sand, I guess, can stay. Blood and fat can move. Well, eventually. Uh, I've just clogged up my inventory again, haven't I? Yep. Oh, well, these things will happen. Now, Merchant Day is just around the corner. We don't have enough cakes. Considering I really, really, really wanted to go and uh, do a bunch of stuff in the... Um, in the mining camp today, things haven't quite gone to plan. Nevertheless, I'm fairly happy with the overall result of what we've gotten done. Let's drop these off. Uh, the mushrooms as well. Hemp. Hmm. Hemp I'm not sure about. Where should I store that? Yeah, I guess we could store it over here. That isn't too much of a problem. But we've got many, many things that we're going to need. And ultimately, we do need to hit the, the mining camp today. So that's going to be the first thing we do in the next episode. Is We're going we're gonna to grab a bunch of fishing supplies, and we're just going to head to camp. I'm not going to worry about the merchant day. We're going to skip it. Uh, because if I don't make some sacrifices, then I'll never make a progress, basically. Uh, I, have to, I have to balance things out a little bit better. I will take the fat away from here as well. Eventually, we are actually going to want that to be brought back, but we don't need to worry about it just yet. Okay, that's good enough for me. We still need to go and visit the witch as well. So we've got a couple of things that I need to uh, keep my mind on, but uh, for the time being, let's just start building up all of these items and storing them for use later. Uh, we'll take the... Yeah, we'll, we'll take the spider's webs and I'll just store them up here because I don't know... Well, I know that they can be used for alchemy, but beyond that, I'm not really sure if they can be used for anything else, like maybe making them into thread because that silk, uh, that silk cloth, maybe that's how we get it, spider silk. That would be particularly nice. Spider silk is... Well, actually, that would be ridiculously fancy for, for a pew. I'm going to be honest. The... the, the Effort that goes into harvesting enough spider silk to actually make something from it is astronomical. It carries a rather exorbitant price. Eh, I guess my pilgrims are worth it. Still, still, I think I think we could actually just like buy the farm and the cathedral and most of the town if we just started farming spider silk. But that will be a plan for a future episode, I suppose. But thank you very much for joining me for this one. I hope you enjoyed the foray into the dungeon and meeting some new uh, enemies down there. But that's going to be it from me. So until next time, and as always, do take care, keepers.